Hi friends, I am so glad to see everybody today and Max and I are so excited to do some more learning with you today. Ah, uh, I can't wait. So Max should make the schedule right now. Let's do it, Max. Let's do it. The first thing we're going to do today is fast calendar time. And when calendar time is finished, it'll be time for center time. Uh -huh. And when center time is finished, we're going to say goodbye. Let's do it, okay? Let's do our body check and get ready for some awesome learning. Um, I'm going to put on my listing ears. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to put in my looking eyes. And I'm going to put in my brain. I am ready to learn, learn, learn. So let's do it. What do I need to do? Turn on the smart board. Let's do it. Okay, come on. Let's find out about today. It's very, very special. Okay, come on. Okay. So we know that the month is October. The month is October. Yesterday was Wednesday, and Wednesday is finished. Today is Thursday, and we now have 22 days in October, and it's a friend's birthday. Woohoo! We want to sing happy birthday to this friend, okay? Max, come on over and let's sing happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, special friend. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. We hope that your day is very, very special. We're going to send you some birthday hugs, okay? Oh, send you two birthday hugs and sending them your way. I think we should send you five birthday hugs, okay? One, two, three birthday hugs, four birthday hugs and five big birthday hugs for you. We hope your day is very, very special, and we can't wait to hear all about it, okay? Yay, happy birthday. Max, come on over and check our schedule, okay? That was fast calendar time because the most important thing happening today is your birthday. Um, calendar time is finished, and now it's time for center time. So I want to show you at center time today this really great book. The title is Let's Go Camping and this book really gave me important information to know, hey, what do we need when we go camping? And so I want to show you something. It says in our book that you can do fun things when you go camping you might even go fishing and catch fish. And that you need to get your tent ready when you go camping. Oh, and then check this out right here, this picture. I see something that looks hot. And these kids are cooking something over this fire. It says that campers cook food over a campfire. They roast hot dogs with a stick. Oh, wow. This is something that you can use when you're camping. It's called a campfire. It's made out of wood and it's hot. It has a fire. So we know that we're going to be super careful with that. Only grown-ups make a campfire. And do you see how these kids are sitting far away? Because they're being safe. They don't want to get too hot with the fire. You have to stay back. And only adults 
only grown-ups make the campfire. You use the campfire to cook food. Because when you're camping in the forest, there is no microwave, there is no oven, there's no stove. You have to find another way to make your food hot. And a fire can do that. Hey, wait, you know what? We need to make us a pretend campfire if we're talking about going camping. I got an idea. I was outside and I found something to make a campfire with. Oh, this is wood. It is a piece of tree and you need pieces of trees, some logs, big pieces of tree called logs or some little sticks to make a campfire. And you have to put the logs and the sticks all together. So let's see if I can make, I'm gonna to try to move the camera a little bit so you can see our campfire. Oh, oh I am going to put, hang on. Oh no, friends, I hope you're not getting too dizzy from the camera moving around. Okay, so look, I'm making a campfire. And I need some more wood. Oh, yeah. oh, you see that? Now, this is a pretend campfire. And so I'm just going to put in some paper that looks like a hot fire. Oh, look, I'm making a campfire with the wood. Oh, yeah, look, it's a campfire. Hey, I have an idea. On the smart board, I can make it sound like a campfire too. You might want to do this at your house on, on your computer. Your mom, your dad, your grown-up can write the word campfire sounds on YouTube and you can make it sound like a real campfires at your house. Watch this. Watch this. Okay, check this out. I'll be right back. to turn the lights out so it seems like we're at night time. Ooh, look, it's the campfire. Now, if that was a real campfire, I would stay far away because it's hot. There's wood, some tree logs on the campfire, and it's hot. Do you know what's fun to do at a campfire? It's fun to get a stick and a marshmallow and cook your marshmallows. Ah, oh, they taste so good. I'm gonna pretend to cook a marshmallow over the campfire. Ooh, yeah. This is like we're camping in the forest for real. Blow my marshmallow, I don't want it to get too hot. Miss McLean likes marshmallows over the campfire. They taste so good. Uh -oh. Uh oh, gotta blow it. Don't get too hot. fun to do um, when you're at a campfire. It's fun to tell stories around the campfire. Oh yeah, okay. You want to tell a story together around the campfire? Okay, I'll tell a story. Okay, so let me think. Okay, one time, a long time ago, there was a little boy and a little girl, and they were walking in the forest. 
they were hiking, taking a walk in the forest. And they were singing songs. La, 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 la. Ooh. Having a fun time in the forest. And then, all of a sudden, they heard a sound. Crack! And they said, oh no, what is it? They looked around. <gasps> what made that sound? Oh no. Then they heard another sound. Crackle, 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 crackle. <gasps> oh no. What could it be? And then they saw a little bunny rabbit. Hopping down the trail. <laughs> there is hopping in the forest. <laughs> that was a good story. I thought it was going to be a bear, but no, it was a bunny, a rabbit, hopping in the forest. <laughs> wow, that's a good story. <laughs> sometimes stories are silly around the campfire, and sometimes the stories can be woo scary. <laughs> Oh, got to just toast my marshmallows. This is so fun. Today at your house, if you want to go outside and get some sticks or some tree branches, you can make you a pretend campfire, a pretend one, just like we have it. Make it pretend. And you could pretend to make marshmallows over the campfire. You could tell stories around the campfire. Oh, you could even paint a campfire. I just used paper to make some logs, some tree branches, and then I used my hands to make the pretend fire. Uh, you know what, something else you might wanna do if you have marshmallows at your house? You could paint with marshmallows. Oh, that's really fun to do, too. Ah, wow. This is so fun to just pretend that we're at a campfire today. Oh, I love it. Have a fabulous time today pretending to make a campfire or making a campfire with your paper and paints or crayons or even painting with a marshmallow. Hey, and you could even maybe go inside your house and put the computer or TV on and you could have a pretend campfire at your house. It feels really cozy and warm to have a pretend campfire on your TV or computer. Hey, Max, come on over and check our schedule. Today at Center Time, we learned a new word. We learned the word campfire. We know that a campfire is something you can have when you're camping. It can cook food. It's made out of wood and fire. And it can keep you warm at night when you're camping out in the forest. So have a fun time with your campfire. And center time is finished, and we'll see you tomorrow, okay? Have a great day. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye, friends.